<laughs> Happy Monday, everybody. What's going on? Today is Monday, February 14th. It's Valentine's Day and my uncle's birthday. Happy Valentine's Day to those of you who celebrate and happy Monday to those of you who don't. Um, thought I was going to be able to just sit in the house and relax. It was a crazy weekend. We had events uh, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. But um, nope, duty calls. Got to return the chairs that we rented for the event back over to Fayetteville. And for me, that's going to be a total of about three, three and a half hours of driving. So trying to hurry up, get it done so I can come be under the one that I love. Yeah. How are y'all doing today? I love you guys. Have you checked out the new series? If you haven't, check it out. All right. I'll keep you updated. Hi guys! So I had to drop off the chairs from the Valentine's Day event. Here! Isn't this gorgeous? This is gorgeous. All right guys, I wanted to give you a sneak peek. Bye! Snellville. <laughs> Cause it's such a beautiful store as well. Y'all, y'all gotta come here. Y'all have to come here. One of the owners, <laughs> Selena. Look at this, y'all. Honey, I got that red velvet. Y'all see that red velvet over there? I got that one and I got the carrot cake. When I tell you it's bussin' bussin'. Oh. Hi, guys. I had to stop in real quick. And this is Small Cakes, right? To Small Cakes in Beaufort, Georgia. Honey, y'all know I've been trying to get this weight off me, but tonight. I'm having all the cake and ice cream. Do you hear me? I had to come in. The service was excellent. It was stellar. The ice cream was chef's kiss. Y'all gotta come check it out. Look at that. All right, bye y'all. Cupcakes. Small cakes. Won't stop. Comedy. Boo bear. Daddy boo. Oh, I am so excited. I bought a candle from Goose Goose Creek Candle, America's best candles. I got it because EJ Speaks told me to. And yeah, I'm gonna open the box. Let's see. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, oh. All right, guys, I got a candle called Fresh Baked Bread. Y'all know I'm fat, but since I'm trying not to eat bread as much, I guess it would be better for me to smell it. <laughs> mm. 
<laughs> I like it. I like it a lot. Goose Creek. Germany. It's a Germany world traveler candle. I'm here for it. What do you think, Dennis? A cold loaf of bread. <laughs> a cold loaf of bread. I'm ready to burn it. Okay. <laughs> What's going on, guys? I'm about to film part three of my series the why you are not ring ready series putting on just a little color on my face so i can look alive I'll put on a little concealer. I'm putting on a little gloss. Yes, I use gloss as blush sometimes, especially if I don't have it. How are y'all doing today? For those of you who are new at my channel, I used to have this thing called Contouring Conversations. I used to really do my makeup and we used to talk about certain topics. All right, guys. If you haven't checked out the Why You Are Not Ring Ready series, make sure you check that out. All right, let me record. <laughs> My camera. <laughs> How did she spread it like a football player? Do you hear me? Honey. Bliss chased Sydney up the street for cookies. Did you? Yes. Right, when you turned around? And barefooted now? I'm fast as our shoes. <laughs> Why are y'all dragging her? Okay. Move. Okay, girl, help me out. Your feet on her shoes, JP. You're just oh my god. Did y'all just see her cheat? Yes, sir. That's crazy. Y'all got a cheater in the family. <laughs> Look at Chef JoJo in the building. I don't know why Chef Smalls decided to put us together again. Come on. All right, fam. Let me get to work for Chef JoJo bust my chops. All right, guys, we finished. It was a great, awesome. Morris Chestnut was in the building, y'all. Great actor. And Chef Jojo, he did it. A great job. Y'all see I'm out of breath, cause honey, we was hauling stuff out. He did a great job. It was a great event. The people seem very pleased with the food. Shout out to Chef Smalls. Actually, Chef Phil Philip Smalls with Small Bites. This was his catering gig. And um, Chef Jojo and I supported him because that's important in the industry and with your business community. 
Don't just always look to make money or take the next gig and every gig, but there's enough for everybody. And when your fellow chef needs help, you step in and you help, right? Say bye to the people, Chef Jojo. Yo, yo peace, peace, peace. Yes. Great event. Period. Period. In and out. Period. It's still Easy. daylight. Exactly. Come on, come on. 2.30. Yes. We done? Yes. Cleaned up? Come on. Niggas even mopped too. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what thank you. So I appreciate yes. you, man. Yes. He's I the best, y'all. I love working with Chef Jojo. Uh, He's the best. the MVP. She keep me calm. <laughs> <laughs> keep me calm. <laughs> All right. Bye, y'all. No, out. tell him where to hear your music. You got lots oh. of music. He got more yeah. followers than me. I only got 3,000, honey. He got like 100K. Not yet. Not yet. Yeah, Soon. 30K. Soon. A little sign. Soon yes. Though. Yep. But yeah, you can find me on all platforms. J Music. J underscore M U Z I Q U E. You're. Check out. I dropped something on the 17th. Something oh. Ooh. be in my feelings, but you know, that's what people like. <laughs> <laughs> they like feelings. They, they like, like feelings. feelings. So that's what we do. You know what I'm saying? Yes. It's check there. him out. All right, guys. Bye. All right, guys, same day. I'm at the building. We got a repass tomorrow, so tables and chairs and other nonsense is going up. There's Uncle John over there. Y'all only see Uncle Big Fella on the live stream in the chat. You actually get to see him in person. <laughs> there you go. And look, look at my family over there. I'm telling you, they don't ever get no break. They don't ever get no break. Look, and then you gotta go to Stone Mountain too. Look, there's Brother Dennis. Hey, look, look, never stop, never stop. Lord, so y'all, we got the tables and chairs out. Oh, thank you to this Don. Not, not dynamic trio, tremendous trio. Uncle John, Brother Dennis, Sister Linda for helping me get it out because I probably would have been in here laid on the floor on my phone until I got tired. All right, guys, I just want to give you the next clip. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye. Hey, y'all, I just want to come on real quick and show you guys this. Reese's potato chip. Reese's cup. I'm like, ew, but mm, ew, mm, ew, mm. I'm gonna try it. It's a big one. You can't really taste the potato chip. It just tastes like a slightly salty, really crispy Reese's. Honestly, it tastes exactly like the Reese's pretzel to me. Like, almost identical. He saw my work ethic. He saw me in the weight room. He saw me stand out extra. He saw me just wanting to be better. And then, you know, we had a bunch of knuckleheads on the team and stuff like that. So he's like, man, this dude. I like ah, him. It's he's all right. Like, you want to go to the Penn State football camp? You got the money together. What did you think about him, Mike? I'm like, man, he's nasty. So to the camp, he hey, said it's nasty. I'm you can taste the chip? But man, it's camp, man. 
Really? They taste the potato. I don't know. I just taste Reese. Like he don't like it. I think it's all right. I don't think I'd buy it again though. I'd buy the pretzel one over this one.